really have to address the things that inclusive dialogue with regions. And of course, you can make a good policy. We have to have a political decision on the visa freeze of the uh, areas of cooperation. Mr. Shikorsky mentioned about them. For the, the, the educational companies, for us, it's close to Ukraine. Uh, secondly, uh, because Today we are witnessing collapse of international order and fundamental principles of European security architecture. The geopolitics unfortunately is back and uh, we need to be equally vigilant, vigorous and visionary. For us, for Georgia, this is first of all competition of values. In this context we see guarantee of our secure and stable democratic development in fostering European and Euro-Atlantic integration. For Georgia, this is a national idea and civilizational choice that enjoys support of the uh, wider population and political elite, elite, and that makes Georgia unique among Eastern Partnership countries. 20% of Georgia's territory is still occupied by Russia. Russia continues moves on so-called borderization and even more recently signed uh, agreement for more deep integration with uh, um, occupation regime in Sukhumi. Another agreement is under preparation with South Ossetia which is definitely a step forward of annexation of Georgian territories. So, and I want to stress that in all this story uh, that we face today, by no means Ukraine, despite the fact that this is the burning issue, is not an isolated case. It's just one part of big Russian scenario to expand its dominance in so-called and create so-called spheres of influence. So we are literally punished for our choice, for our sovereign choice to be part of European and Euro-Atlantic community. Crisis in and around Ukraine is very much on our agenda and has uh, taken most of our time and energy for many months. Uh, and I appreciate the fact that uh, the US administration shows their concerns and also their interest in, in forging the right uh, strategy for uh, solving this problem. Uh, one of the proofs is the conference we are uh, participating at, but I want to appreciate especially uh, the attention uh, demonstrated by the White House, by the White Pre Vice President Biden, who met with uh, some of the participants at this, this conference. And uh, we had a very good meeting uh, meeting where he was asking about what we think, how we see the way out, how we see uh, our future strategy and our policies. So it was very frank, very open uh, discussion among partners. We, uh, and uh, from that, persp that perspective, I found it uh, encouraging and, and very useful. You, you've seen the great event, the, the great appearance of our people who are taking decisions on many things and it's important for both of our nations to come here when the Eastern Partnership and the Riga Summit and I mean, more general our future, European future is discussed. That's where we can argue, that's where we can bring our arguments to and when we can feel the temperature, you know, we understand where, how far we can go and what, what can we have in our, in, in what we are trying to achieve. Thank you.